Aqualane Shores is one of the premier waterfront neighborhoods in the city of Naples. Located between the elite community of Port Royal and the seaside village neighborhood of Old Naples, Aqualane Shores features a variety of properties. From older homes on tranquil canals, to oversized dry lots two blocks from the beach, to large estates overlooking wide expanses of Naples Bay. Many homes are just a few blocks away from the historic district of Old Naples, with its unique boutique shopping and award-winning restaurants. And all homes are with an easy bike ride to all that Old Naples has to offer. Aqualane Shores was developed beginning in 1950, when Naples had only about 5,000 residents. Forrest Walker and Sons purchased 300 acres that included extensive mangrove wetlands just south of the main part of town. With Forrest on the bulldozer, Lorenzo Walker on the six-inch hydraulic dredge, and R.L. Walker on the drag line that uprooted the mangroves, a practice long since prohibited, Aqualane Shores was shaped over the next 10 years. The Walker started with an old drainage ditch that ran from Gordon Drive and within months had dug up what is now Anhinga Channel between 14th and 15th Avenue South and started selling one-third acre lots for $4,000 and the few larger Bayview lots for $7,000. They also extended 3rd Street southward and created over 20 oversized dry lots that run between 15th Avenue South and 18th Avenue South and 3rd Street and Gordon Drive, half of which are large enough to allow separate guest houses. These properties are especially popular for their two-block proximity to the beach and easy walking distance to the historic shopping area. As dredging and filling progressed to the end of what is now 17th Avenue South, rock appeared just below the surface, so the walkers continued filling into the bay to provide these properties with navigable water. This tongue of land, which is now Aqua Circle at the end of 17th Avenue South, features many of the neighborhood's largest lots and most expansive bay views. This is also where you will find some of the newest and most luxurious homes in the neighborhood. When the east-west teen avenues, 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, and 18th were finished, the walkers turned 90 degrees and dug out wider north-south canals to create the fingers of 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, and 8th Street South, which are now premium lots with wider canal views. The walkers connected these waterways to three small ponds they then dug out to create very desirable Aqua Cove, where a couple dozen current homeowners enjoy some of the neighborhood's largest lots and widest water views that are not on the bay. Development continued at the southernmost reaches of Aqualane Shores with 21st Avenue South, again running east and west, with the addition of Southwinds Drive, Forest Lane, and Marina Drive, with waterways that connect with Jamaica Channel, which marks the northern end of Port Royal. It is worth noting that there are a few expansive estate properties in this area that rarely come on the market, bringing the total number of properties to just over 350, about 40 of which offer beautiful wide views across Naples Bay. At this southern end of Aqualane Shores, just west of 21st Avenue South, Residents enjoy a hidden pathway that provides beach access from Gordon Drive between beautiful gulffront homes that mark the beginning of the Port Royal area. A sprinkling of the original homes built in the 1960s and 70s still remain, and some have been lovingly updated. Most, however, have made way for newer, more spacious residences, and there's always continuing new construction that offers the very best in modern design and amenities. Several of the streets in Aqualane Shores are lined in a theme of regal royal palms or mature mahoganies, which arch over the roadways in lovely shaded canopies. Of course, the main reason people choose Aqualane Shores is having a backyard dock that provides quick boating access to Naples Bay, the Gulf of Mexico, and the beautiful intercoastal waterway that meanders through the pristine mangrove forest of the Rookery Bay National Estuarine Research Reserve on the way to Marco Island. It is quite common to spot dolphin, egrets, osprey, and hinga, cormorants, and a variety of herons. A rare and special treat would be to spot a solitary manatee or a small flock of roseate spoonbills. The fishing, both backwater and offshore, will satisfy the most avid angler, especially with a day trip to the famous 10,000 Islands south of Marco. It is important to note that having direct access to Naples Bay and the inland waterway means that boaters can enjoy relatively smooth cruising even during the windier months of winter. Featuring boat docks and water views, along with proximity to the beach and the many amenities of Old Naples, Aqualane Shores is sure to remain one of the most desirable Naples neighborhoods. For more information on this and other Naples real estate, 
Visit one of our offices in Old Naples, click through the Gulf Coast International Properties website at www.gcipnaples.com, download our mobile app, or call us at 239-434-2558. We are the premier Naples boutique real estate company specializing in Port Royal, Aqualane Shores, Old Naples, Royal Harbor, Coquina Sands, the Moorings, Park Shore, and select golf communities. We look forward to working with you.